Every girl, every boy, come on, open up your eyes. There's a world right here, full of wonder and surprise. Let's go and find the thimbles. Thimbles, thimbles, thimbles. Where the thimbles? and waving. Mm, I'm going to have a little nap now. See you later. <laughs> let's tidy up, let's tidy up, let's tidy, tidy up. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sorry, Ribble. <laughs> oh, hello, Bessie. What are you doing today? Well, I'm just bessieing around here, doing a bit of tidying up. <laughs> <laughs> and Ribbles ribbling around, aren't you, lovey? Yes. Oh, Ribbles, there you are. <laughs> I didn't see you under that gold tinsel. <laughs> it looks like you've got gold hair. <laughs> yes, Goldilocks. Oh, yes, Ribble. You do look like Goldilocks. <laughs> Goldie Ribble. <laughs> Shall we go and show the others? Oh, yes, please. Hiya, you what? <laughs> Come got a pout, come got a pout. You won't guess what's in it. Have a go. It's small and round. You hold it in your hand. Drinky, drinky. <laughs> Can you guess? Guess what's in Pom's pouch? It's a cup. <laughs> 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 One, two, oh, there's three gone. One, two, three, ha, oh, three cups. Oh, Pum find others. Cool, there's someone sleeping under my tree. Who's sleeping in my bed? <laughs> I know those feet. 
I know that tummy. And I know that top knot. It's Fimbo. Hello, Fimbo. Oh, he's asleep. Uh, but he shouldn't be sleeping on my tree. He should be sleeping in the comfy corner. Um, I'd better tell him. Fimbo, wake up. Wake up, Fimbo. Oh. I know. I'll tickle his ears. That always works. Uh, tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> uh, Fimbo! Fimbo! Oh, wakey, wakey! Fimbo! 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 Right. Fimbo, if you don't wake up right away, I'm going to eat every single crumble cracker in Fimble Valley. Uh, what? 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 <laughs> Hello, Fimbo, sleepyhead. You're awake. Oh, well, I am now. Why did you wake me up, Rocket? Because you were asleep. Well, I know I was asleep. But you were sleeping in my bed, and you should be sleeping in your own bed. You woke me up just to tell me that? Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, hello, Fimbo. Hello, Rocket. Hello, Pompity Pum Pum Pum. Oh, hello, Pom. <laughs> um, what are you doing? A oh, Pom counting cups. One. Two, three. Uh, uh, thank you, Pom. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Look at Ribble. He's got golden hair today. Oh, Goldilocks. <laughs> yes, he does look like Goldilocks. <laughs> <laughs> Goldie Ribble. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> <gasps> Did you hear that? We know, we know what, what that, that is. is. It's the flowers on the tinkling tree. Look at the tinkling tree. The tinkling tree's telling me something. <gasps> Look, my fingers are twinkling. <gasps> <gasps> I think your fingers are twinkling too. Just a little bit. <laughs> Can you see your fingers twinkling? Oh, oh. Look, Pom's nose twinkling. Oh. Your nose twinkling too. You feel your nose twinkling? Oh, look, my top knot's twitching. I think your top knot's twitching too. Can you feel your top knot twitching? <laughs> oh, that's a fimbling feeling. We're getting the fimbling feeling. And we're going to find something. Hooray! I can feel a tickling. I can hear a sound. It's telling me there's something waiting to be found. Where is it? Where, Where is, is it? What could it be? I think it might be over oh. there. Let's go and see. Oh, there is something to be found here. Where is it? Is it here? Oh, no. Uh, it's here. <laughs> Can you see it anywhere? Can you see it? Oh, point, point. There it is. We found it. Oh, hey, thank, thank you, you for helping, helping us. <gasps> oh, look. It's a book. It's a big book. A pretty book. Our very own book. <laughs> I wonder what's inside it. Oh, hello, Chucky Eggs. What's going on? Oh, Bessie, look what we found. A book. Oh, what fun. What do you think is inside it, Bessie? Oh, <laughs> it could be so many things. You can find all sorts of things in a book. Books are so exciting. Shall we have a look at some of the things you might find? Oh, yes, yes please, Bessie. Then come with me. Come and see the big wide world. The big wide world. We've got lots of different books. This one squeaks. This 
one's got flaps, I can lift them up. This book rattles. This book's all fluffy. Brum brum, this book's got wheels. What's inside our book? Uh, let's look. Oh, yes, Mum. Let's have a look. <gasps> oh, oh stripey! Tippity tuppity. It's a, a. What sort of book is it, Bessie? Well, it's a pop up book. The pictures pop up and tell you a story. Well, what's this story, Bessie? Uh -huh. Shall we see if we can work out what it is? Oh, yes. Oh. Now, what's this picture of? Looks like someone's sleeping in their own bed, Fimbo. <laughs> yes, Rocket, and no one's waking them up. Mm. Oh, but who can it be? Shall we have a look at another picture? Oh, yes. Ah, oh. oh, look! One, two, three! Three bowls. A big one. A middle-sized one. And a small one. Ooh. So we've got a bed with someone sleeping in it. And three bowls. What story could this be? Hmm. Let's try another picture, shall we? Oh, yes. yes. Oh, this little girl. Oh, yes, with golden hair. Uh, oh, just like you, Goldie Ribble. Hello there, everyone. It looks as though you're having fun. Oh, Rolly, look what we found. It's a book, a pop-up book. A story, story. Ah, so you found a pop-up book. How exciting. And what has it got in it? It's got a picture of someone asleep in a bed. And one, two, three balls. And a little girl with golden hair. Oh, I see. Uh, Rolly, read story now. Oh, I certainly will, Pom. I'll just go and get my book and I'll be back. In, in a very Hmm. When you take a look inside a book, it's fun as fun can be. Oh, now what have we here? When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you might see? A story or rhyme, just take the time to read along with me. Ah, here we are. Now, are you all sitting comfortably? Yes. Good. Then I'll begin. This story is called... Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Oh, that's right. Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Once upon a time, there were three bears. Father Bear, Mother Bear and Baby Bear. They were very happy, except that Baby Bear had no one to play with. One morning, Mother Bear made some porridge. And while the porridge was cooling down, Father Bear said, Let's go for a walk. So they did. Somebody else was out for a walk that morning. It was Goldilocks. When she came to the bear's house, Goldilocks could see three bowls of porridge. Oh, I'm rather hungry, said Goldilocks. So she tried the first bowl. It was too hot. The second bowl was too cold. The third bowl was just right, so she ate it all up. Then Goldilocks said, Oh, I'm rather tired. So she went upstairs. She tried the first bed. It was too hard. The second bed was too soft. The third bed was just right, so she fell fast asleep. Soon the three bears came back. Father Bear said, Who's been eating my porridge? Mother Bear said, Who's been eating my porridge? Baby Bear said, Somebody's been eating my porridge and they've eaten it all up. 
The three bears went upstairs. Father bear said, Who's been sleeping in my bed? Mother bear said, Who's been sleeping in my bed? Baby bear said, Somebody's been sleeping in my bed and she's still there. When Goldilocks saw the three bears, she was so surprised she ran straight down the stairs. Oh, do stay and play with me, said Baby Bear. So Goldilocks did play with Baby Bear, and Mother Bear made some more delicious porridge. <laughs> Lovely. Did you enjoy that story? Oh, <laughs> yes, yes Lovely. Lovely. And well done, everybody, for working out what the story was. Come on, everyone, let's sing our Goldilocks song. Sing, sing! When Goldilocks went to the house of the bears, what did her wide eyes see? A bowl that was big, a bowl that was small, a bowl that was in between. When Goldilocks went to the house of the bears, what did her wide eyes see? A bed that was big, a bed that was small, a bed that was in between, big and small. She counted them one, two, three. When the bears returned to the house of the bears, what did their wide eyes see? A bowl that was big, a bowl that was small, and a bowl that was <laughs> empty. When the bears returned to the house of the bears, what did their wide eyes see? Who's been sleeping in my bed? Riddle! <laughs> oh, the Fimbles have had a guessing day. <laughs> Can you remember who got the Fimbling feeling today? It was Fimble, Flory and Pop. And they found a book. A very special book with pop-up pictures. Are you pretending to be somebody else now? Let me see. Who could you be? Oh, could you be Little Red Riding Ribble? <laughs> Perhaps you could pretend to be someone else today. Come and find us next time, won't you? Now it's time for us to go. Cheerio! Cheerio.